Okay, I'm back from my dig today. I imagine I spent roughly four hours out there digging up the yard. It looks awful. But here's my finds. I have this, whatever it is, a screwdriver. I don't know what it was used for. I'm sure it was used to hotwire some car at some time. A uh, piece of aluminum. Looks like Santa's sled almost, doesn't it? Let's see, what else do I have here? Obvious, uh, I'm sure everybody's found these uh, beer bottle caps. A hammerhead. Look at that. That is a real hammerhead shark. I found this hammerhead shark in my yard. Unbelievable. And there's stuff growing out of it. Here's some chess pieces from King Henry time period. I'm sure you all have seen that before. Uh, let's see. A valve, valve cap. Piece of aluminum. Another piece that says 16 centimeters. An electrical adapter. Outlet adapter. Uh, probably dating from the early 1800s. This came from a UFO. That we all know. Very common, very common. Not one, but two tire weights. And I even found a ring. Not one ring, but I found two rings. Here's a ring. And here's a ring. Striker plate to a, to a door. I'm sure it belonged to some bank that got blown up. Uh, there's a spring. A lid to something copper uh, let's see that looks like lead droppings and oh I found an E now if anybody out there in YouTube has a name with an E Ethel uh, Elizabeth Eleanor Emmett guess what I have your necklace it's an E um, this is quite interesting, really, right here. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it says two cycle, 16 to 1. So it must have been on some implement. Uh, let's see. Found an old pill box. It's silver. Uh, it has some designs and writing on it. I'll, I'll let you know what the writing says eventually once I clean this stuff up and there's something here that has some letters to it now look at that now there's a prize Ooh. it's an Indian arrowhead and it belonged to Chief Chili yep quite a warrior everybody knows Chief Chili and this is his arrowhead we have some buttons um, let's see, three keys, three keys to your heart, found a stem to a, uh, a dart, I guess there's some metal in that, and then whatever this is, now, that could have been a pull knob, but I think it's, actually it went to you know, in World War One, those Germans had those spikes on the top of their hat or their helmet. This has to be what it went to. Only this went to a flamboyant German soldier because it has real nice designs. So his spike was really nice. Uh, let's get down down here. Old Navy. This belonged to the Old Navy. It's a stick pin. And look at this. A Viking warrior. Oh, that's really old. Okay, here's the coins I found. I found four quarters, six dimes, seven dimes, and a whole shitload of pennies. Look at all them. Now, you know, I was hoping that, that I'd have a penny at least that would be... Uh, a wheat penny? Not a single wheat penny. There's some nickels there. 
dimes and whatnot, but nothing nothing old except for for two things that I did find that that I know are probably worth something. I found this a mercury head dime, and it's in rather good shape. And the date on it is uh, let's see, 1943. And then I found this. It was really odd. And I cleaned it up and I got to looking at it. And it says luxury tax token Louisiana and it has a five on it. So uh, I, I don't know anything about that. I guess I can look it up. But I believe that these two things out of four or five hours of digging in my yard are probably uh, uh, keepable. The rest of this, if y'all want to write me, I'll package it up and I'll gladly send it to you. Uh, you can have fun with it or whatever you want. And uh, uh, But I think I'll keep, keep that dime and that luxury tax thing. So uh, there again, four hours of digging in my yard. And this is what I produced. Now I have uh, roughly another acre to go. So... Uh, We'll see what I, I dig up as time goes by. Thanks for viewing and putting up with my crap. Uh, actually, I had a lot of fun metal detector detecting. Uh, what what the family gave me was a bounty hunter gold digger, and I'm quite pleased with it. Uh, I'm sure that's just a uh, uh, a beginner's model. Uh, most of you people are probably very advanced. Uh, also, uh, I would like to have any hints. Or helpful uh, advice that you can send to me uh, I, I'd appreciate it but uh, this is what I got today y'all have some happy digging bye